Hello! Yes! Hello! Welcome back, humans and dinosaurs. This is Lafo, and today we are back. Yes, it's been a while since I lasted a proper stream. That is no, not Monarchy, right? Yes, so exams are over. Not technically. There is like one English exam left next week. But I never study for English anyways, so... <laughs> like me? Studying for English? No way. <laughs> I mean, it's not like that I'm good at English, but I mean... I can speak it, right? So, like, why should I study? Lol. <laughs> so, uh, yes. So, there is this new dinosaur game. So, human dinosaurs. There is this new dinosaur game called Rise of Kong. Okay? So, apparently, it's very bad. And, like, and you guys know when it comes to bad dinosaur games. Like, what comes to your mind if you think about a terrible dinosaur game, right? You immediately think of the Isle, Path of Titans, uh... Prior extinction, right? So let's see. So I decided to go ahead and you know, it couldn't be possibly be worse than those games, right? So yeah, I decided to buy the game. <laughs> I haven't actually played it because I don't know. I want to see your reaction first, okay? If it's that bad, if I get if I get to finish this game within two hours, I don't think so. It's said to be around five hours, but if the dinosaur game game pod finishes easily within the first two hours, then I just might as well refund this whole thing, but <laughs> I haven't even, I bought this game, but I haven't played it yet, so I think I can technically still refund it, so <laughs> it's, it's apparently shittier than Gollum, but here's the question, right? I don't care if it's shittier than Gollum because I haven't played Gollum, but is it shittier than the Isle? So, <laughs> okay, so uh, first, I did want to see, show something really cool. So there's some really cool thing that I found on the internet before uh, we play the game. So we're gonna look up on that first, right? So. Wait. Okay, so there is this, uh, this. So this is apparently concept art from the game. So the, yeah, the concept art actually looks pretty amazing. Amazing. So uh, yeah, because from what I've heard, the developers were forced to play. Uh, they were forced to finish this game within a single year. So they obviously had not enough time to trim out and like create a full thing. So that's why the ending result was really sloppy. But yeah, like this is one of the concept art for the creatures. It's apparently called a terra, a terra claw. Yeah, does, isn't that technically just Deinonychus? Like, Terraclaw? Deinonychus? Isn't, isn't that exactly the same thing? <laughs> Deinonychus? It looks like a weird cross between a Therizinosaurus and a raptor. Which, once for some reason, Yu-Gi-Oh has a Therizino raptor. Yeah, that's an actual thing, by the way. But yeah, whatever. So, uh, yeah, we have that. And yeah, this is what the, the thing was based off. Like, it looks genuinely really cool. What, what, whatever the hell they were, like, planning, like, were, were thinking of when they were first making the game. Like, it, the concept bot is amazing. But, like, the end result is pretty much shit. Oh, yeah, also, uh, yeah, the life on our planet. Like, that's, that's the thing, right? Yeah, it's, it's, it's actually released. I haven't got time to watch it just yet. Right now, I want to push out uh, two videos every day. That's what I promised. And it will happen. So, uh, from beginning tomorrow. I said it was today, but it was yesterday, so... Technically, yes, it's starting from tomorrow, so... Yeah, whatever. So, yeah, from tomorrow, we're gonna be having two-day video daily uploads, because... Yes, I feel sorry for not making any videos for the past three weeks. Three weeks?! Like, like, Jesus freaking Christ, Lofo. Three weeks?! Just go ahead and... You should've just... Go ahead and just off yourself, Lofo. Like, that's just better for the world, man. <laughs> a content creator that, had, that hasn't made a video in three weeks. Wow. <laughs> just... Just go... Uh, Lofo, search up for the next... Could have the closest cliff nearside you, right? You, you can pull off a Disney's Carnotaur, right? <laughs> so, whatever. So, next up, we have another concept art. So, yes. This, this is a thing. Rise of Kong has a fucking Molosaurus in their game. Like, I was gonna, like, say, like, eh, is the game really that good? But, I like, I was like, like, they have a freaking Molosaurus. And I'm like, you need to get this game, Lofo. <laughs> So yeah, Molosaurus is a, is a thing, so I, I have to buy this, right? So yeah, there, these are the models from the game, so yeah, it's, it's very, they look very odd, so um, 
Lofo, play P Peter Jackson's King Kong. That was made for PS2, but somehow was way better. Here's the thing, guys. I don't care if necessarily if the game is good or not, okay? Like, this game is new. It's a new, new flashy thing. Hence, I'm playing it, right? I, I don't have bright expectations. Heck, the... Uh, heck, even Best in Slot. He played the game. And he said, like, it was not worth the money. I refunded it. Do not play the game. It's not so bad. It's good. It's just bad. That's what, apparently what he said. But, again, I'm not here to, ga to get an enjoyable gaming experience. I'm here to entertain you. These two are different things. And, yeah, that's why I'm playing this. Because if you want to play, want to see me play the original King Kong game, you just, just watch the gaming play Beaver Plate or something. <laughs> yeah, isn't that, isn't that, like, a story-driven game? Like, I've seen it, like, I've watched it a long time ago, I think, cut three, four years, five years ago, yeah, I've, I've seen it, like, it's, it's a good game, don't get me wrong, but, like, I feel like, as a content creator, this is the game I should be playing, not the other one, so, <laughs> uh, yeah, so, we have this, uh, this weird humanoid rapper, honestly, like, I don't know what the hell is up with this rapper, it looks like some weird-ass furry design, like, a scaly design, whatever, I don't, I'm not really, I don't really care about the nomenclature of those things, so, yeah, we have this, also this weird purple wrapper. I don't know what this purple wrapper is. I think I've seen it somewhere before. It's, it's, it's not, like, no, I, I've seen this design before. Like, I can't put my finger on exactly where, but I, I'm pretty sure I've seen this purple wrapper before somewhere. It's not this game. I think it might have been some weird, uh, what was those, those weird mutant things? The weird dino froze creatures? I think one of those looked kind of similar to the wrapper. Uh, we, we also have this very cool feathered raptor, I guess. Looks kind of like Chameleon from Dino Hunter Deadly Shores. Like, the color scheme reminds me of that guy. Yeah, who remembers Dino Hunter Deadly Shores? Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I'm the only one who remembers that game. And we also have this weird terabird that has theropod claws, so. Yeah, very interesting in general. Uh, there's more lineup, so there's even more creatures outside of the dinosaurs, so. Uh, yeah, we got a brute mother thing. Uh, brute mother thing? Uh, weird Kezo thing. Uh, with pterosaur thing? I don't know. We'll, we'll see, we'll see, honestly. Uh, it, it, the creature design, like, creature to the roster, honestly, doesn't look that bad. <laughs> so, yes. I've committed the tragic sin of buying this game. Right? Not, not this game. Rim, Rimworld is amazing, guys. You guys should totally play Rimworld, right? I know that you guys complain about, oh, Rimworld, it's, it's, it, it's, it looks boring. It's com complicated. It's convoluted. Like, yeah, it is, but, like, you gotta give it a shot. Like, until you haven't given a shot, you cannot say that this is a bad game. Like, it, RimWorld is amazing, right? If you download all dinosaur mods, you played with, not on the hardest difficulty, you played on, like, adventure mode or something like that. It's, it's, it's not, honestly not that bad. It's, it's decently enjoyable, so. Uh, hey, how are you doing? How's streaming going? Uh, it's doing, it's going alright. It's just, I just started streaming, so, uh, it's been, like, 10 minutes since I started stream, so... Yeah, and we're gonna play Rise of Kong, so... Yeah, because it's got dinosaurs in it, so... Uh, Alright, Skull Island, Rise of Kong! I haven't played it, I just bought the game for $42, because... When the first- the game first came out, the game was on sale. But because I was doing on exams, I, I saw the store page having- having this game on sale, and I was like... Oh yeah, I'll probably buy it, uh... I'll probably buy it in a couple of weeks. Uh, I'll probably buy it once I'm- once I get home from the library. Guess what? Lofo ended up staying the entire night in the library because he was busy studying. And he ended up sleeping the next day because then the- uh, then the- because that was the end of the first exam. So, there was a couple days left until the next exam. So, I was like, you know what? Sh sh screw that. I'm gonna go to bed. And I slept. I completely forgot about the this game being on sale. So, I had jumped on today and thinking- oh, like- I was like, oh shit, this game was on sale, right? And I, I just clicked on it, wasn't on sale. So I had to buy this game for $42. <laughs> I could have treated myself to, to two very nice dinosaur toys, but no, you, you get Skull Island Rise of Kong. <laughs> yes, a, 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 like a true, a, it's a true, the struggles of a true content creator. We play Skull Island, Ri uh, Island Rise of Kong. <laughs> Let's go, right. <laughs> Let's friggin' go. So, uh, Kaithin, uh, how was your day? Uh, you doing- you've been, been doing any dinosaur things? Like, what, what brought you to this- for- to my channel? Like, you- you like dinosaurs? 
It's it's every time we're, we're like with YouTube, right? The you when if, if every time I stream on YouTube, right? The YouTube is the mostly it's the algorithm. So when people jump to my channel to watch my streams, I know that they're coming in here because I do dinosaur stuff. So like they they kind of know me. They probably watch some of my videos. They probably watch my Papo T Rex analytics video, and they're like, oh yeah, this guy's a funny guy. He's like a VTuber that does dinosaur stuff, right? And he's like, oh, this guy actually streams. He plays this new shitty Kong game. What could be in store for me? So you click on it. So you're like. Oh my, that's that's a pretty awesome. Uh, he's he knows about dinosaurs. He's pretty chill, right? Uh, but when people jump on Twitch, I don't know why they are here. <laughs> because on Twitch, they don't come here because uh, they don't join the stream because uh, because they know what I usually do. They just see me playing Rise of Kong, so they're like, oh my, I should go ahead and play this. Uh, I I should go and watch this game because guy who. He seems like a VTuber, he seems like he's playing Rise of Kong, so, uh, why not? <laughs> oh, oh, what? the game already started, oh shit, I didn't even notice that, right? The game, like, oh my god, I just realized, the game didn't even start for me, right? It, it was on my taskbar, but it didn't appear, okay. Hopefully that doesn't count towards the playtime, because I haven't... <laughs> Wait! Guys, the game program is called Monkey. I shit you not, you guys gotta see this. <laughs> the game launcher program is literally called Monkey Windows 64 Shipping.exe. <laughs> you cannot make this shit up. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why is this a thing? Oh, okay, what? Well, oh, oh my god, right? <laughs> Monkey, right? Monkey. Uh, okay. I mean, it's it's monkey indeed. It's it's monkey time indeed. Jeez, right? <gasps> okay, right. Okay. You, let me know if the game voice is too loud or the game is too quiet. Right. Hold up. Let's see. Audio. Right. Music. Right. Is it save? Subtitle quality enable. Disable. Okay. Uh. Is it is why is subtitle quality enable or disable? I I I thought it would be something like uh like fast, quick, or like big bold letters or something like Comic Sans or some shit. <laughs> yes, this this program is literally called Monkey XE. <laughs> I didn't even know that, right? <laughs> okay, so quality setting high. Okay, right. Okay, so uh so yes, humans and dinosaurs, welcome to Skull Island: Rise of Kong. Yeah, um, monkey booty at the stun. It's just amazing, right? Let's go. Okay, empty, right? Oh, okay. Skull Island, Rise of Kong. There are stories of gods told by fanatics. Stories of kings told by the oppressed. The sea stories told by the gullible. However, the stories of this age-old island are passed on from generation willing to tell a much bigger tale. The stories of the beasts and their king. The story of Kong. It was not long ago when the Kong species began to disappear. The battles among the island's beasts have existed long before anyone could even recall them. Still, the survival of the Kongs against larger and more ferocious creatures was no longer guaranteed Ooh, is that a strike? as generations passed. The story I will tell you starts at a time of danger and uncertainty for the last remaining Kong family. Raising a child, especially protecting him from the violent beasts, was hard work. And the ever-present threats of the island eventually took their toll 
on this decimated family. Jesus Christ, she speaks very slowly. Are you really trying to squeeze out the two hours of my free playtime with this? Okay, right, there we go, finally. Okay. I'm monkey. <laughs> okay, let's see. You can move and jump with space. Okay, thank you for telling me There's such viable information. Okay. Okay, I can also sprint. I can do the monkey run. Yes. It just looks so goofy, right? Okay. Oh. What the hell? All right. Let me up. Let me up. I hear some dinosaur sounds outside. But right, you guys, uh, how loud is the game for you? I think it's it's like it seems really loud on your on your end, right? Right. Let me know if the game volume is too loud because remember, guys, I'm doing this for a video. So if if you guys have any issues with the audio, you guys have to tell me that, okay? Right. Please, I, I'm begging you guys. Oh, can I climb this? This looks like something I could climb. No. Right. Shitty game design. Right. Whee! Monkey! Oh, what the hell is now? Night storms are a bad omen in times of crisis. And the Kongs do it well. This guy looks like it's made out of rubber. The fire. And the son had yet to return from hunting. Oh, that was the mom? I thought that was the dad or Kong. Fearing right. the worst, decided to venture out in search of her family. <laughs> That's so goofy. <laughs> right. Okay, monkey.exe. Okay, basic attack. Uh, okay, uh, pressing consecutively. Okay, heavy attack using Q. I'll probably forget about this within the next three seconds. Oh! Oh, hello! What are you? It's, it's these little terrible things. Oh. Oh, I can roll on it as well. I can talk. Okay, camera follow them. Block your enemies using tab, okay. Crit for rolling while in combat, okay. Freaking Dark Souls here. Oh, I can roll them over! I can roll them over! <laughs> I can roll over these birds! Okay. Right, or dinosaurs. I mean, pretty much both, right? Destroy by holding down the button Q. Okay. Smash! Rolly. Monkey do the rolly poly. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, jump. Sprint jump, okay. Thank you for the valuable information, game. You can also attack. Okay. Oh my, okay. He's clapping the shit out of these Polydiptorix things. Right. You just have to use art crack at the right moment, okay. How? Oh, it's stunned. Is that how you do it? Right. Let's go. Okay. The game is going to tell me about climbing vines, isn't it? Yeah. What is this? Oh, it's heal, heal root. Okay, heal root. I have to grab smaller enemies. Oh, okay, smaller enemies. I should have. There's loads of controls for this. Okay, glowing red. You can also do a finish. Oh, raptor! Oh my! Ah! F! No, I just died. I just killed it. 
Well, I guess I, I, I just might as well just spam click, I guess. What is E? Oh, 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 okay, I did something. I don't know what, what I did there. Special bar. Uh, well, spinning with the cost of her savagery meter, okay. Uh, alright, so it's like a crit meter, okay, sure. <laughs> Monkey angry. Right, charge! Wait, why does this not work? Wait, is, you literally told me that that's how it works. Wait, what? what? The hell? What am I supposed to do here? Will it go down? No. Oh! Oh, there's rappers up there! Oh, 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 okay, there we go! Oh my, okay. Stupid Sarazino rappers, right? Okay, right. I want to do the finisher. Oh, 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 there we go. <laughs> Banana Slammer! Right. Okay, seriously? How am I supposed to get past this? Am I missing something? Controls. You guys know how to get past this. Uh, this game really wants me to just take take the L and move on, huh? Okay, you told me that I can slam rocks using Q. What the hell? What? Am I missing something? Right, I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys, some of you guys, ha is, it's not the first time you guys are watching this. What do I need to do? It's, it's the game is saving, so... You know, fall damage, okay, that's good. Well, the game is preventing me from climbing any higher, so... That must mean that whatever I have to do is it's over here. What am I supposed to do? I must be missing something here. Oh my, what the hell was that? What? Load a save file to see it's fixed. Uh, auto save.
to maybe the game wanted me to do something with the roar and the game didn't trigger it because I, I already used the roar by accident maybe that's why All right come down here they're just like oh they're kissing oh right come here lovebirds stop kissing each other and stop fighting me They are really heavily doing the. <laughs> right then, uh, right. I, I, I thought I was supposed to kill the guys. You guys are just making out, right? Sure. No, I, I think it's got something to do with the bar. There we go. Okay. Jeez. I have to manually go there. Talk about really bad game design. Okay, grab it. Okay, I'm, let me just do this, right? I swear to God, if this is what it makes it work. What are the controls? Direct heavy attack. Oh, maybe I have to hold? Oh, yes, you hold it, right? I forgot, right? Jeez, okay. Slam! I have to hold it down. Okay, there is what left or right? Left. Because left is always right. That doesn't make any sense. Right. Right, jump. And while that guy's just dancing. Right. Banana slammer. Jump. Yeah. Not anymore. Banana Slammer! Right, jump over you. And Banana Slammer! Right. Not gonna lie, that is kind of funny. That feels good, getting that in. Right. Come on, Banana Slammer! Right. I love how the, how the small guy just waits for me to finish that guy off. How kind of him. Okay, well, let's see what's, what was on the other side. Well, I don't know what's on the other side. The game won't let me, allow me to know that, right? I guess it's forbidden knowledge, right? What is this? Along your way, you'll find other types of obstacles you can destroy by pressing the R button three times and then ground on once in the air. Is that lava? That looks like a piece of gum that has been stuck at my on the bottom of my classroom's chair for the last three years. <laughs> well, I guess there we go. Destroy the gum. Jeez, that was disgusting. Leap. Uh, base. Hold down tab and use space. Oh! Oh, 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 okay. Wait, am I stuck down here now? There we go. Okay. Yoink! 
Okay, I mean, it, it kind of worked. Right. <laughs> Okay, do I have to leap up over here as well? I think so. I could see how to leap. <laughs> oh my. What? Is there a map? No. Oh, I have to do it over here, I think. Yeah! Genius love bow. Okay. Come on. Not rocket science. There's things I can use to climb up to the sideways. Okay. Oh yes, sideways monkey, very sneaky, sneaky monkey. <laughs> right. Honestly, people people say that this game is bad because it, it's got terrible graphics. But honestly, I don't really mind the terrible gra graphics too much, like. Oh, nice. Let's go deeper and deeper. Because, like, it. Because if you say that bad graphics usually makes a game bad, that must mean that graphics that have great graphics must be good, right? Not really. You, you see the aisle. The, the game looks amazing, but the game actually, actually is pretty much shit, so. What am I supposed to do here? Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta leave, right? The way this is going, it's not the it's not the dad Kong and the baby Kong that is getting lost. It's it's Mama Kong that's gonna get lost. Oh! Throw a rock. Okay. Hold F to pick a rock and aim. Right. Oh yeah, it's monkey time. Yeah. Throw rock! Right. Amazing. Really struggling with this game, not gonna lie. But I, I was never good with these kind of games. I have to move around and find a not exit. Oh, there, there's hidden steps here. <laughs> you look like a you look like an egg with dragon wings as ears and elf ears as antennas. You have a Walmart flower in your head and you're wearing a Christmas shirt in Halloween. Hey, maybe I'm dressed up as a very uh, maybe I just dressed up as an egg with the dragon wings as ears and elf ears as ant antennas and you have a wall and I also have a walnut flower in my head. <laughs> and, you know, who says that it's seasonal, right? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what I was just saying. I was just rambling, right? And it's, honestly, I don't care. I, I look ridiculous. I know. <laughs> I know, sweetheart. Right. Okay, like, where? 
How am I supposed to move around? I'm just struggling right now. What am I, what am I supposed to do here? Like, no, th but you guys say, oh, the game is shitty. No, this is, this isn't, like, the game design problem. It's, 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 it's just intelligence problem on my end right now. I'm just stupid right now. What am I doing wrong? Yeah, people are like, oh, like, I remember people shitting about, like, a game developer when they, on, like, I think it was a horror game. Where they made like out, made the uh, ladders yellow, and they were like, "Oh, like shit! That is that, that's just bad storytelling." Everyone knows that you climb up ladders, and then there's people like me who, like, if you don't have these visual cues, you don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like, <laughs> there's people like me who can't do shit, right? So, what, what what is what is going on right now? Okay. I feel like I'm just going back. This is where I'm supposed to go? I feel like I climbed all the way over here to begin with. Didn't I do the monkey sneaky thing? Right. What am I supposed to do here? Well, I'm just stupid right now. I mean, the game showed me a tutorial where I throw rocks, so it probably must mean that I'm on the right path, right? Yeah. Okay, there was a way to get back up, which means that this has to be where I go, but like, I, I thought there was some sort of cave egg entrance here, but there isn't. What? Oh my god. So stupid, what? By this, I mean like Lofo's brain because don't seem to be able to comprehend what's going on right now. Right. So I did these two jumps. I killed those Caldipterix things o o over on this rock. So, which means that the game wanted me to jump on this rock to trigger the Caldipterix. Dip the Rick scene, right? <laughs> Correct, sir. Exactly. Right. This isn't the game problem, it's my intelligence. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so the game wanted me to jump over, right? So it wanted me to go down, do this jump, and go over. But why? Why can't I just jump down here from here there to begin with? Right? Okay, then the, the rocks allow me to go back up. So that must mean that I'm, I, that the game wants me to go back up and climb these vines, right? But I came from these vines. Is there like a hidden thing behind these vines or something? No. Oh my god, what's going on? I can see my jaws. Oh, <laughs> Look at this, I, I, I'm just jaw. <laughs> right. Would you, would you just please move? Right. I, I think I'm supposed to go over here. But I... Okay, I thought for a second I was stuck. What am I supposed to do? Oh, 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 I see Caldipterix is up there. Oh! Okay, all right. Okay. I gotta go back up over there, all right. God damn it. All right, okay, okay. All right, game. Thank you. Thank you for these weird pla weirdly placed card up I I've no idea what they would could possibly be doing in this area this time of day. Located entirely within that rocky cliff. With no food or no light anywhere to be seen. But yeah, sure, why not? Uh, environmental storytelling, right? Right. Yoink! God damn it! <laughs> right. Uh, 
Alright, skill issue, Lofo, skill issue. Right. At least I know where to go. Oh yeah, I do this right. Okay. And you do this right. Seems simple enough. Yes, thank you, Lofo. Jesus Christ, that took ages. <laughs> right. Oh, finally. You can leap as a combat dude. Banana slumber! Well, that didn't do any damage. Right. Yep. Banana slumber! Right. That crack is just so satisfying. Oink. Come here. Wait. Okay. Executioner. Execute ten creatures. Yeah, freaking executioner right here. <laughs> Call me the executioner, monkey. You can perform epic actions. Wow, okay. It's epic, truly epic. Right, you have to do jump and the air. Okay. Oh, the epic epic attack isn't doing anything, sir. I mean, it's just better off just slapping these guys. I mean, I guess it's epic attack because it looks epic. They never said it actually dealt any damage. It's just said it. It's it's it looks epic. That's why it's called an epic move. It doesn't actually deal any damage. Just think of it as a bad Nintendo game, right? Like, that's that's what I think when I play this game. Like, it's just a bad Nintendo game. Like, Combat of Giants... Oh, it's a... Oh, it's a Raptor! Oh, it's, it's, it's that Sapien Raptor thing, right? <laughs> they move so... S they move so slowly, it's like... <laughs> Dies, okay. Why well, so tragic? Don't you realize there's like a raptor right in front of him right now? There's no time for that stuff. So. Oh, 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 okay, there we go. Go! Okay, parry! Okay! See a light, you can parry, okay, stun, okay. Right. I wonder if I can locally kill this guy. I think this is one of those boss battles where you're meant to die, but... You know that I'm a Korean, and a Korean never tolerates something like that. You know what? It, I, I, I haven't made... I'm gonna make this my challenge to kill this guy. Right, can I... Oh, well. No! <laughs> no! Like, I love how it's supposed to show some emotion in its eyes, but 
Because it's just, it's just like a 3D model, it just doesn't have any motion, so you just get an awkward close-up of its eye. <laughs> Last survivors of the Kongs had perished against the fury of Gaul. Except for a small infant. Call it luck. Will. Or destiny. The last of the Kongs had survived thanks to his parents' sacrifice and his own perseverance. Really? It wasn't wasn't it just because that the rat didn't give a shit about this guy? <laughs> but that was not enough. Kong yearned for vengeance. Okay, right. To take the life, take the life. Wait, 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 what? Okay, whatever. That took away his family. Oh, that's a cool looking creature. But he was weak. He could not fight without surviving first. And for years, he could not do anything but grow in the middle of the island's dangers. Gong was alone now. But Kong would have to overcome the constant fear of larger more powerful, hungrier beasts in order to survive. But the fury, the memories, and the desire for revenge gave him a reason to stand tall and wait for the day he could face God with the strength to defeat her. Well, what was that effect? <laughs> Screen shake. It's just like a, it's like a goofy Korean Saturday morning cartoon that you see on TVs. <laughs> okay. okay. Right. Okay. Thanks. Right, uh, can only save one manual save? Okay, load. Oh, I can only load that? Oh no, I can't go back? I want to fight them all though, right? I, I want to fight that guy, huh? God damn it, like, I, I, because, you know, every time there's like, there's like a Dark Soul type where there's like a boss, they, that, it has a health bar, technically. I want to defeat it! It's always been my goal to want to defeat one of those, because I, I always saw when people defeat their boss to get an extra buff or something. <sighs> like, a secret bonus or some treat. And because I never played a Dark Souls game because it doesn't have any dinosaurs, that was the first time I ever got to experience something like that. And the game just refuses me to do that! Shitty game. Right. I want a challenge, bring it on! What are those? Oh, it's the ultimate life form! Crabs! Right. Don't worry, Kong, don't fight it. In a couple million years, you'll end up just like these guys. Right. Oh, wow, these, these, these crabbies are strong. Holy crap, right? There we go. Crab legs for dinner, eh? Uh, hello. More crabbies. Whee! 
So from what I've heard, like if these enemies that you see like while you're passing, like even if you kill them, they don't give anything. So essentially they're worthless. They don't, there's no XP system. The XP is given out if you finish the level. Did that call that direct thing just vanish? Let's just ignore that, right? We're just gonna pretend and see, think that nothing happened, right? <laughs> that guy was like charging towards me the one second and next second he was a like, gone. He was a disappearing dinosaur. I guess he went out to get to grab the milk, I guess. Uh, roll power to move enemies during way during combat. You'll be and are able to identify to you and identify places of interest. Roar. Uh, uh, okay. The, well, we got some pterosaurs flying away. Okay, does it mean that that's the place of interest or the or that place where they're flying away? Again, simple environmental storytelling that Lofo is too stupid to realize. Can you not do the leap? Is not is this not how you do the leap? Right, I guess not. Love is too stupid, right? Hello, Prime. What 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 now? Wait. Why am I- why am I half a rock right now? <laughs> my, my- my feet are tied to a rock. Yes. Well, okay. Okay, how do I do the leap? Isn't it you do this and you hold space? Oh, maybe you just charge here? Oh, hello! Oh, these guys are all waiting down here, right? I think it's just do it's, it's a charge run thing, right? Okay, sorry guys. I know it's super frustrating watching me play through play this. But hey, you aren't gonna pay forty dollars for this, right? <gasps> ah, yes, there we go, that's actually okay. No! No! God dang it! Yeah, right. As, as much as you guys would find my playthrough abysmal, you guys aren't actually gonna play the game and do it yourself. So, yeah, just shut up and watch. <laughs> right. Because here's the thing, guys. Right? Like, unlike what most people say, like, I don't find this game that bad, okay? It's, it's probably because my plate of games is much, much more loosened. Like, whether, like, the way I decide a game is fun, first criteria is that it has dinosaurs in it. Right. Okay, pickable object. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, that's a pickable object, right? Okay, how do I pick it up again? Okay, I don't know. I, I, I didn't read. Okay. See, Lofo, you lack, you lack reading comprehension. Like, this is why you'd suck at Korean, right? And you took the Korean SATs, right? What was grab? Okay, F hold, right? There we go. Okay, that was, that was a weird animation. What, 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 what just disappeared? Okay, whatever. Right. Hold up. There we go. Come on. Home run! Ignore them, right? <laughs> so you know that that is why I find the aisle. That's that's why I find find the aisle so interesting, right? Because it literally meets all the criteria of a game that I should I should be liking. It's got dinosaurs in it. 
Like, it's an online dinosaur game. How could you not like it, Lofo? But the game is absolutely abysmal. Right. I played I, I played this game right now for like the past 10 minutes. Like, no, for the past 50 minutes. And I can say for clarity, if you're gonna buy the Island Path of Titans, just buy this. Right. At least I'm doing something right now. <laughs> right. Get. Yoink! Ah! Right. Ah! But yes, as I said, if a game is dinosaurs, chances are, God dang it, <laughs> I'll I'll be I'll be enjoying the game. So, God damn it, what is this? Is it some sort of like, if it if it this was Ark, there would be like a survivor up here somewhere. Is this some area where I have to gather some art collectible that I don't know of? I don't know. <laughs> when you will be releasing the Dinostorm videos, the videos are being edited. That's all I can say. It's it's in edit. Maybe it will release tomorrow or the day after. But I need right now. I need to focus on editing Monarchy. Right. How do I get back up? Oh my God, Lofo! Right. Why can't I not do the leap? Isn't that something that you were supposed to be doing? What's going on? Okay. Weird crystals, great. Is that a dead Dano? No, that's it's a log. Right, but yes, right now for the next couple of days, the dinosaur media is gonna be eating good. So we got the new documentary coming out on Netflix. Arc Ascended trailer is gonna release very soon. Honestly, I'm not so sure when it releases. What is it? What is this? Z? Kong statue. Okay. Find your first collectible. All right. Oh, what is that? It looks like a Ramparinkus thing. Oh, look at that! Looky, looky. Well, they seem pretty weak. What are these huts? Right, like these huts in the, the this these things weren't made by Kong, right? So, what is this? Some weird game theory time? But I know for a certain the only reason MatPat would ever do a video on this game if is if it was sponsored. Unfortunately, <laughs> he's probably too busy watching the new FNAF movie. Oh, fighting Clay the Clay the Zone. Just two Cardiptorixes. Uh, wh why is it? Why is it? It's literally two Cardipt Cardiptorix things. Why is this treated like a big challenge of a sort? Okay. Oh, oh okay. 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 There's more than two. All right. Oh, there's more of them. Okay. It's like a swarm. Oh. 
Oh, no, you don't. No! Oh my, I might actually die here. That's how much I suck in these games. Oh wait, what? I just... What the hell? Okay. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I died to that. Okay. Let's do better, Lofo. Right. This mistake won't happen twice. Right. First time is a mistake. Second time, it's proof that you're a failure. I mean, you are one, not gonna lie, Lofo. But still, let's pretend that I'm not, right? Yeah, honestly, the log is bullshit, right? Just, just slam them. It's way faster. I don't know why you're, why you're using the log. I think it deals like the white damage of slapping these things, from what I can roughly see. But still, like, it's, it's not worth it. The time spent on slapping these guys is much faster than the time you would be spending on uh, feeding them. Like, you're slapping them is much faster. Oh, come on! Okay, come on! Do, do the thing! Yes. Come here. It's just the fact that I suck at this, right? Right. Come on, Lofo. Come on! Finish him! Finish him! Yes! Yes! There we go. Jeez. <laughs> Uh, one skill points. Yes, Th this is why we. Th this is what we want. You want these skill points. Whoa. That was harder than I thought. It's not the fact that the game is hard, because that I suck. Oh god! Ooh, what are these? Ooh, crust the pterosaur. Not this one. That one. You're just chilling. All right. You guys know that I love anything that has crests. And to prove my love, I'll be beating this guy to death. Oh, these, these guys can stun! Oh, I can do a finisher on these guys as well? Oh! <laughs> Bro, that's brutal, right? What are these, stone crabs? Oh my shit. Oh, it's Kong fighting in those that, that Indominus Rex thing. Okay. Wait. Why can't I not move? I can't move. I'm pressing WAC, it doesn't move. What the hell? Do I have to do the fight all over again? No.
No, the, the... It doesn't work. The controls don't work. I kid you not. <laughs> what? Okay. Let's try this again. Okay, there we go. Right. That was so weird. Right, cross the pterosaur. Come here. Right. Yeah! Crack its neck. <laughs> Let's fight the ultimate life form. We need to defeat this guy. I, I, I want to ki kill at least one of each Skull Island creature. Right. That's my goal here. Right. I don't care about Kong's revenge or anything. I just want to kill at least one of each. And that's my goal. Right. Okay, how do I do the slam again? I can also do war, but okay, let's just go. Go, Lofo. Just go. I cannot beat the ultimate life form. Oh, what the hell? What is this now? Destroy all the nests? Uh, What nests? Well, let's go. Go, 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 go! Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't even die when I'm, uh, when I'm stuck on the vine. I just, just, just game over. It's just... Okay, there we go. How am I supposed to gain health? Go, 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 go. Grab it, grab it. It gives so little health. Oh my god. Right. Even the game developers didn't expect that I I'd suck I'd suck at this game this badly. Right. Go Lofo, go 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 go. Destroy all the nests. What nests? What nests do you mean? I didn't see any. Even with my keen sense of oh, I see. Uh, you just use a heavy attack with Q. Okay. Hey, there we go. Look at these bones. What are these bones from? There's a plant. What are those? Right. Underground thing. Okay, what are you? Oh, it's like... Weird... Dune worm thing. Alright. Oh, these things spit! Right. Come here! No! Come, come on. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I love how I just, I just glitch into the ground while I do the move. Slap! <laughs> Crush his head. He's just destroying nests for no reason. Yeah, I guess he's just fe feeling a bit devilish today. You know, I feel a bit wonky. I, I feel like I feel very goofy, gooby right now. So. I shall proceed to eliminate this this entire dinosaur, f uh, not dinosaur, this entire pterosaur's family's uh, familyhood, I guess. I, in in that kind of sense, if you think about it that way, this guy's even worse than the red raptor, because at least the red raptor let the babies live. <gasps> but this guy, no, we're gonna kill the parents and the babies. Screw that. Truly double standards, huh? Well, now we just need to wait for a sequel. 
Not King, not Kong Skull Island, but Ter Terrasol number one Skull Island. So what the hell are those things on the left though? I don't get, are these worms, snakes? What is that? It's just very confusing. So now I actually have to fight these things. Judging from experience, I gotta go ahead and take these spitters down first. Okay, finishing off gives a bit of health, so I gotta use that. Okay, how do I- the, the crabs are rather tanky. Have to kill the pterosaur and the snake? Uh, and the crab just, just need to kill that guy? Alright. So what, what now though? I assume I just go back up this way? Right. Narrative storytelling, guys. Narrative storytelling. I mean, environmental storytelling, yes. There we go. For some reason I couldn't move on that vine, but I could jump. More of those things? <laughs> They're just swimming. Wait, are they actually fighting each other? Oh, they're actually fighting! Oh, that's cool! That is actually pretty cool to see. You know, AI and creatures interacting with the environment? Damn! Like, look at that, Dundee. You should learn from this. Right. <laughs> right. Damn, AI creatures that fight each other. Wow, Dundee's gonna get his mind blown after this one. Right. How do I get back up though? Okay, there's there's a ladder up there, right? It looks goofy, but I guess this will have to do. So what what is this way? Ooh, even the small pterosaur said. Okay, that's cool. Oh, fighting clay to zone. Well, now, now you guys are teaming. I thought you guys weren't. Go away, Ramparinkus things. I, I'm pretty sure these guys have their own name. Let me know what they're called. I know that those raptors that you see, that those are like terror claws. But what are the others? Oh my god, right. Let's go, King Kong! Use your skill points. Okay, see, this is why we, when we need those.
Oh, what is this? Oh! Slip and slide. Right, looks like we're fighting this giant Kizu thing. It's it's called Earth Gija. Okay. I assume these guys are gonna spit. Oh no, these stunned. Okay. So what is a stone? Can I interact with it? No. Oh, what? I wasn't- I wasn't the back of it! Looks like a giant Kezu thing, not gonna lie. Yeah, it's just Kezu, but the body's like inside the ground. Right, god damn it, Lofo. Seriously, fell for the same trick twice in a row. Oh! Oh, okay. Is it, is it, is it like Dark Souls? Does it have multiple phases? Let's see what it does first. Okay, once it pops up, it does a next slam. I guess we gotta wait until it does the swing. And then we go in. But how am I supposed to go in when it just disappears right afterwards? I didn't even deal any damage there. Like, it has these rocks. It spawns rocks, so that must mean I must be doing something with them, right? Maybe this is just a shitty boss fight and I didn't think too much about it. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm supposed to hit this guy right now. Should have done it. Try it again, right? Oh, use a rock. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> I completely forgot about the rock being a thing, right? Okay, that explains it, right? Yeah, I didn't even think about throwing a rock because I was in the sand, like in a dune. Like, where the hell do I get a rock from? Do I, do I just pull a rock out of my ass? Okay, love, you don't even. You shouldn't even think about it, right? So that's what these rocks are for. They're like kind of like barriers for you to throw to prevent throwing the rock, huh?
Doesn't seem to do any damage. second phase right but why does it not work on the first phase it's the same creature it, it should be working that's so stupid it works on the first phase not doesn't work on the first phase but it sure as hell does on the second what does that mean It does, it does deal damage, bro. Just just a slight tiny bit of mana, bro. Just gotta aim it really good though. You're gonna aim it also slightly up. do any damage what well I wouldn't say it's super effective just barely effective assuming looking at the HP I'm actually dealing to this thing okay, that's so weird there's like times where the rock clearly hits the creature but it's not dealing any damage uh, not this one but there are there's been a couple er issues here I have to do this for how long? Like every time it jumps out, I'm lucky to get like a single hit on this thing. Should have been a hit. I guess it's their old it's their strategy to prevent me from like finishing the game, right? To and uh, refunding it. Yeah, if we just give the ball a shit ton of help, maybe they just won't bother to play this within an hour, right? Direct hit. Right. Just, just go all out, in. Yeah, just go all out. Screw that. Right. I have more health. Just, just, just kill him. Right. Just tank it, Lofo. Right. Ah! Right. I don't care. Yeah, just, just go in. This is much damage in. Ah, that sneaky son of a gun. So you're playing the game that uses the JPG for the cutscene. Yes. And I... Pl the one experience that I can say is that it's way better than the aisle, so... I might not be enjoying it, but still, it's decent for content, I'd say. 
Yeah, there we go. Yeah. But does the rock spawn when it comes? Yes, the rock does spawn when it comes back. But I'm not so sure what I'm supposed to do with it. But that's the thing. Like I can't destroy it. I can't interact with it. Like, heck, I thought, like, that would deal any damage if I would- Maybe I have to, like, lure him to, like, to jump- For it to, like, you know, to jump up underneath the rock and maybe that would deal damage to it? But no, like, there's no reason why the rock exists. It's, they are just there. I don't know why. I mean, I feel like they- th There must be a reason these rocks- uh, rocks exist. Hence, they wouldn't be spawning them, but I just don't know why. They're doing something, I just don't know what. And honestly, I just couldn't care. Come on! At this point, just turn tail and run, Kazu thing. Oh, you're pretty much dead. What are you even fighting for? Oh! 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 Okay, there we go! God, the cutscenes are so dog water shit. Like, <laughs> I can't even. I, okay, I even I admit, right? Maybe the game isn't that bad, but damn, the cutscenes are bad. <laughs> now, how the hell are you gonna get that out now, huh? How do I even do the skills? How? Oh, oh! There! Okay, that's how you do it. Right. So what is this? Kong General Properties. Uh, uh, something. Uh, Kong Rage Properties. Something. Something. Right. Uh, basic attacks and tackle damage. Throw rock at bigger, faster Grant's armor. What the hell does Grant's armor mean? Right. Shoulder check is a short recovery animation if it doesn't hit an enemy. Enemy, right. I guess basic attack up. Let's just, let's just. Okay, how much skill points do I have? One of the three branches for each skill. Oh, okay, I see. I have three skill points. Right, that must mean I can unlock something else. Right, arm up during primal rage, damage up, savage meter will deplete least slowly out of combat. I I've never really done primal rage. Uh. I guess armor up. We just want to stay alive long. Oh, it's too expensive. Okay, I can't do that, right? Okay. Okay, what now? Oh! Oh! Oh, this this giant rock platform was there. Oh, stupid me. I didn't realize that was a thing. <laughs> yeah, while I was fighting the giant Kezo monster, I sure as hell didn't see this giant, very convenient platform that just came out of fucking nowhere. Which I'm currently struggling to climb because I suck at this. <gasps> just, just come on, man. Don't be a wuss, right? Oh, what is this? Oh, no. <laughs> right, let's see if there's any heal plants here. No, right. Where's, where's all the creatures? They all disappeared. I guess they all ran away. Can't wait to see the freaking mollusk. Upgrade your rock throw? Can I reset that? Okay, jungle wetland, but my HP is still at bottom. Right, great. The plants really don't heal much. And how do I save? Okay, 
Did I save? Right. Oh. Destroy all the nests. Okay. All right, let's let's awaken my inner ox survival evolved the hunted skills back again. Oh, this this is giant crab came here. Wait, okay. didn't even see this guy. Oh, we got one of those crescent guys. Ah! Right. Annoying ass guys, go away. Go away. Yoink, yoink, yoink. <laughs> I can't believe this is the fastest way. Oh no! You climb stuff, right? Instead of walking, you just jump up in a very goofy ass way. <laughs> Why? Why is this a thing? Oh! Oh my! Okay. That was actually pretty skillful. Gonna give it credit where it's due. No! God dang it! I'm pretty sure most people would not have a trouble with this. I have because I, I guess I'm just mentally challenged or something, right? But, uh, come on, you can do this. I'm not even gonna risk it now. Just, just go up. No, no, you don't. Right. There we go. Ah, go away. Okay, what now? How am I supposed to climb this up? Oh, wait, what? Okay, that was weird. I just knocked him over and just it, it just reverted back to its default animation there for a second. Right. What the hell? Okay, there we go. Oh, giant crab! No, that's not giant crab, that was a flower, okay. I mean, I do like the pterosaurs, because I feel like what happened with the with the crested pterosaurs is that they looked up pteros pterodactylus on Google, <clears throat> and I think that's where they took inspiration from. So I do like how they're like, they are crested, so I feel like they, they did, you can kind of see that they did try to do some research, like, as I said, the game's roots came from a very good game from came from a very like passionate team of developers but then they wanted to like to finish this entire game within a year and then all that bullshit happened and so we have this What's up with that? that? That's so weird. Is it just me? Like, I think like the the lands over there are they're like moving. Is that's not meant to happen, right? Is is it like a visual glitch, or are there all the walls like actually like moving around and stuff?
I guess we'll name the small crabs Ultimate Life Form 1 and the big ones Ultimate Life Form 2. <laughs> Dude, where the hell is the exit? Why can I not see it? Well, the game is saving, so must mean I'm doing something right. Okay, I guess they just fight crabs, I guess, right? Yep. Oh, what is that? Okay. That's a pretty interesting mechanic. Oh, I can do a finisher. Crab claws. Oh, <laughs> just beat his butt, I guess. Okay. Yeah. Now, not to speak of it, did you know that crabs actually have tails? Yeah. Fun fact: crabs actually have tails. So if you know, if you did not know. The belly that you usually think, like, you know, the belly part is actually the tail of the crab. So, that's, if you see a female crab just having, uh, carrying eggs, you'll notice that, but... Yeah, the tail part of the crab is actually, it's, uh, it's... It's like, its belly is like the egg. Like, the tail is, like, rolled up. So, sometimes if you see crabs with eggs, like, that's, that's because it's, like, in its tail. It has these eggs in its tail. Because it's just so closely located to the body, you don't think of it as a, as a tail. You just think it's a part of its belly, but that's not true. Okay, let's do this. Primal Rage! What now? <laughs> I still get get my ass kicked though. What? Uh, yeah. What are you staring here for? Uh. Do I go inside the cave? Okay. <laughs> That's so funny. I, I think like, I thought there was like something inside of it. So yeah. Ooh, spooky. I just go inside. It just disappears. <laughs> There's nothing. Okay. No. Oh, same with this. Right. <laughs> like, instead of actually putting the wall. They just went ahead, just, they just slapped on like an invisible, like, thin sheet of like black. They couldn't even like make a bother making, I think, a decent lightning system. What is inside this one? Oh, also nothing. Right, should have guessed. First cave had nothing inside of it, the second cave didn't have anything inside of it, so it has to be the third one. Nope, not, not even the third. Ooh, strategically placed logs, amazing. There's no way in hell Lofo is gonna fall off of the, the out of these ones, right? Like, come on, there's no way Lofo is gonna fall from these, right? You just go in a straightforward line. It's as easy as that. How how could you not do this? How do you fail at something as simple as this, right? You 
can. These things again. Hello. Oh, these guys can actually hit me. That's quite annoying. Oh, these guys aren't the big pink crabs. They are, they're the different ones. This game has two types of crabs? Why? Okay, and these crabs are actually pretty strong. What the hell? How far did I get backtracked? I don't know. Hopefully not that far. Oh, over here, right. Let's see if I can actually make this jump. Speed run strat. Ooh, not bad. Already speed running this game. You know, as bad as this game is, I feel like there's gonna be a bunch of people just unironically just speed running this. You know, it's like a platformer. It's got shitty graphics. It's popular for being bad. Like, all the recipes of a good, decent speedrun community is right here. Plus, it's got dinosaurs, and who doesn't like dinosaurs? Ooh. I thought this ledge was something that I used all the I guess not. Just go. Just jump, jump. Jump stride. Yeah, that prevents me from them spinning. Uh, don't, don't touch these white ones. They're really powerful. The big claw crabs I can kill. But like these armored ones, they're, they're really strong. Okay. Ah, god dang it. Ah, shit. Okay. The game must. There's, there's gotta be a reason that game makes me, made me climb this, right? Gotta be a reason, right? There's no way the game is make me, making me go through all that bullshit for nothing. I don't really see another exit outside of this, though. What the hell? Right. What the hell? Maybe this. No. God dang it! Right. Oh my god, just... What am I supposed to do? Right. See, this is why I don't really like these kind of platform open world games. Like, not really open world, but like these kind of games. Because there is a goal, you just have to look for it. And I, I never really like that. I just prefer when everything is like in a straightforward line. 
or there's no line at all. Like, these are kind of games that have these very vague lines that, like, is it this way? Is this that way? There's clearly an exit, but you're just stupid to find it. Never really was a fan of those kind of stuff. Am I supposed to go back up? I think so. Something tells me that that's the case. Crimson Giant Claw and the Great Shield. I feel like these names are unironically kind of cringe. No, that's where I came from. <laughs> Feels like something that that, that makes... It, it, you know these names where you the, the creature itself isn't that cool? But you obviously have these really edgy names to make the creature sound way cooler than they actually are. So you'd have these something called like a Death Horn. Or like Death Stalker. And it's just like a freaking compi. <laughs> With a slightly edgy design. You call that like a freaking death something something. Right? You're still alive! Yes I am! Yes sir! <laughs> it's been an hour and 49 minutes. It's And I think I... I don't know. I I feel like I should just finish this game. You know, just just, just to make the... Put, put the nail on the coffin. Then I'll, I'm the only person that ever finished this game on screen. <laughs> something like that. I don't know. Uh, hey, I mean, the game is more fun than the aisle, what can I say? Oh no, we got these- we got these great shields and stuff, alright. <laughs> and then we just have this blue dude just dancing, right? Oh my- okay. You gotta face my fears, Lopo. You gotta fight that crab. Okay. Call mode! Right. No! Go away! Right. Right. One by one. You! You are the main source of my issue. But how do I defeat this guy? There's gotta be an Oh, do I just war at it? That's what you get. Why not? Jesus Christ, man. It's just advertising. Straight up Latin advertising right there. Jesus Christ, man. You aren't even a regular on this channel, and you just- Oh yeah, I just- I don't even know you, but hey! Yeah, that's- that's all chill and all, but you just immediately start dropping your channel, man? That's pretty cringe behavior right there. Alright, consider that a warning. I feel like I'm running away to around on the same places again and again. Well, unlike the jungle environment, this swamp is just foggy. It's just very hard to see. Am I going the right way? Wait, didn't you guys say that there was a map? There's no map, what do you mean? I don't see the map. Oh, over here. I have no idea where I am. Check your current position. Where is my current position? 
Where even am I? Hello guys. Yeah, they are basically, yeah, yeah, they're definitely based off the ramp fortress. Those little guys. I just find it extremely weird how this swamp is just filled with crabs. Like, it's just crabs, crabs, crabs. Literally where I came from. Well, am I have I been backtracking the entire time? Holy shit. Temple run basically. Uh not so sure what you mean by that. Okay, I mean it says points of interest, but literally everything is point points of interest. These pterosaurs were weird. Pretty sure I passed them earlier. Yeah, I know what Temple Run is. This is where we fought the crabs. Yeah, we're definitely going. We're definitely. Oh, <laughs> that guy got flung. Yeah, I am using roar constantly, but like, what? Okay, the game is indicating I have to climb this, right? Really hard to get lost here, definitely. Okay. Ooh, right. Don't jump down, Lofo. That's that's what I did last time, and apparently that's not the way to go. Okay, there we go. Sideways, sideways, right? Sideways, monkey. A monkey, monkey, sneaky monkey. No, I, I really don't get how this is like an ecosystem, right? Like ninety percent of the swamp ecosystem is just crabs. <laughs> Do they just, it's just like an entire ecosystem just fueled by two, spe like three species of crab. Is that, is that how it works? You know Kong, you must know Godzilla. Yes, I know Godzilla. I've been to Tokyo. I, 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 I've been in the legendary uh, Godzilla statue in uh, Shibuya. The Godzilla Hotel. It's, it's a really good view up there. Plus, you also get it to see a really cool Godzilla head. Hello. Right, guess I'm well loved around this area. Right. Okay, yoink! Wall running! That actually works. Yeah, my favorite Godzilla is Shin. And I. 
And I just really hate the American one because his head is tiny. It just looks like a giant rugby star. So yeah, not really a fan of that design. But I don't really shit on people for not liking it. Like, for not liking it. Like, I am very, uh, oh, I'm very open to, like, wh whoever likes whatever. Like, as long as it's hurt, not hurting anyone, like, I don't really care. <gasps> because my first Godzilla movie that I watched was Shin Godzilla. And I just like, like, the really alien aspect of it. What the hell? Am I not supposed to destroy them? Singular Point is an anime. I've also watched Singular Point. I, I like the Rodan designs and Anduris designs, definitely. That was a, definitely something I liked. Oh, wow. Look, look at that hole in the middle of the body. Damn, that's... That's just terrible design. Right? Oh, I just I just killed it with the rock. Okay. Wait. Oh man, this game is actually good. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's good, but it, it it's it's not bad, right? Let's see. Control. Uh, direct heavy attack. Well, I thought it was you hold Q to open doors, right? Wasn't it that? Wasn't that not the case? That is weird. Bunch of pterosaurs here. Do you have humor? Yes! I do ha in fact have humor. <laughs> Lofo, in fact, did not have humor, <laughs> as obviously stated. But a mushroom! Yes, a mushroom! Thank you! Like, uh, jeez! I thought it was something else, I don't know. Like a legendary Spinophora sail or something, I don't know. But a mushroom? Like, they are everywhere around here. Let me give you this legendary collectible. The mushroom! Hell yes! Am I going over the same places again? Yeah, no way to see. No, I don't think I've been here. At the same time, I have the memory of a goldfish, so maybe I yeah, I did pass this by. I'm just going back, who knows. So there's multiple characters of a Godzilla. I mean, yeah, there's like an American one and a Japanese one. Okay, so there's one thing that I did realize for people that actually play this game. Pro Lofo's gamer tip, right? Pterosaurs always perch, but they never, like, they never sit down once they see you. So if you see pterosaurs that are sitting down, that means that it's a path that you haven't been there. Yeah, definitely. See? Pterosaurs are key. If you see an area that, that has a bunch of flying pterosaurs instead of sitting ones, you know that you've been there before. Hello, crap.
I think the crabs are like stuck on this border. And this one is stuck in the border. Maybe I can make it like glitch out, who knows? Still stuck. Okay, that was weird. Okay. Well, where are the enemies? Oh, there they are. Oh, these cheeky rappers again? Uh, okay, there we go. Now we're seeing. Many of them now. Jump! Got that. Didn't even get to heal off that guy. Face reveal. Don't ask that that question to a VTuber, man. It's considered rude. Although I don't mind it. <laughs> but just keep your information. But no, I I I like I like the being secret. creative. How do I go off of this though? Like, is am I supposed to climb up or? No, it just seems like it's like a separate secluded area. Do you like skibbity toilet? Uh, I, I, I guess so. I don't know what skibbity toilet is. Never really heard about it. <laughs> oh, nope. That's new area. Ooh, the Grand Canyon, but it's not grand, and it does doesn't this is, doesn't look like a canyon. It looks like a rift. Oh, it's big crab. Seriously, this game bothered to make three, like four types of crab. Seriously, you could have just added in like some Spinosaur or some stuff, but instead you go for crabs? Jeez, how uncreative. <laughs> King Dengids, alright. Oh my, where even are you coming from? There you are, right. Yoink. 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 Oh, oh, what, what the hell? Okay. Sneak, yeah? Oh my, okay. Okay, what, what, how am I supposed to kill this guy? Yes, Th this time you can actually see the crab's tail. This tail, this crab's got a tail. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna die. Yep. Right, try again. <laughs> yeah, this is not canon, my guy. It's not supposed to be big. <laughs> well, I think like yeah, that's just the problem that people have noted. I just didn't, I didn't even realize this, right? 
I was just too so focused on the dinosaurs that I forgot King Kong was supposed to be a big ape. <laughs> it just looks like a regular sized gorilla to me in this game. <laughs> Spam him with rocks. Yeah, I realize that. It seems like rock is just the rock meta is the way to go. Okay. Dodge the rocks. Please stop throwing these stupid rocks. It seems like yeah, rocks are rocks all the way to go. Don't even bother getting up close. Just spam it. Oh my, why did I let that hit me? That was stupid. Stop doing that. It's, it's, it's like a snowball fight in like mean like third grade. Instead of snowballs, it's just rocks. Never that good at snowball fighting to begin with. Oh my god, you can't just start swinging at me from the start, that's cheating. Can I parry the rocks? Not really. Stop roaring, man! Give more attack damage. Doesn't really seem that way. Okay, oh this is tedious. So the boss is just programmed to hit exactly where you are. So as long as you just keep moving when it does the throw, you should be just fine.
Yeah, when he gets close, he does not use a rock. Yeah, I, I know that. I know that. I, I've, I've done that before. And, you know, I just feel like it's just more convenient to do this instead of just going in and facing him head on. And just like that, officially two hours have passed since I played, started playing this game, so I cannot refund it, right? <laughs> just taking note here, guys. I, I, I just sacrificed $42 that I'll never get back for this. But still a better economical decision than playing buying Path of Titans and the Isle. It's just, it, it's literally just kindergarten me right now. I'm, I'm just reliving my childhood right here. You know, sometimes with kids in, in my school would get really dare, or dairy and they would go ahead and put rocks in their snowballs. In this case, it's it's like 100% rock and like 1% snow or something. <laughs> Uh, let's play card. <laughs> yeah, dodgeball, exactly. Well, I'm getting the hang of it now. Right. Thank God there's no time limit on this shit. Oh, there we go! I, I somehow got all the way up close? Okay. Oh, we broke off its own! He did not like it. Oh, 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 he's moving! Yeah, and, and is, is, is it just the same thing all over again? Is it? <laughs> I think it is. It's just... Okay, now it just throws uh, a lot more rocks. Okay, it throws like five rocks. But, so instead of just making it challenging, you're just gonna throw me more rocks before you do the roar. Right. Yeah, sure. Just make it more tedious. Hey. That game plan sure work in the aisle. The flowers don't respawn. Peak game design. Yup. They don't even heal like they don't even heal for max health. They heal for like twenty five to like fifty. Oh god! Right. That's what you wanted, huh? Right. Two. Three. Four. Four and roar. Right. I I'm I'm learning basic counting again. It it is really truly like me being in kindergarten again. Damn, what a ten out of ten masterpiece of a game. It's helping me relieve my childhood. Childhood dreams, not really childhood dreams. It's, that's not actually something that actually happened, but. Well, like my childhood moments, yes. That's the best. Wait, what, what the hell? Oh! Quick attack. Nothing really changed, though. Ouch.
Well, at least guy is at least this the crab is helping me become a better rock thrower. That's that's for certain. I used to suck at rock throwing before this boss fight. After this, I'll be pitching home runs in no time. Uh, wait, if wait, if you're the pitcher and you get the home run, isn't that bad? That means you failed at your job. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't played baseball. Whatever. Yeah, because you don't want the enemy to get a home run, because you're the one who throw catches the ball, right? So you want to you know if you you the one who throws the ball. So I, I don't know I don't know how baseball works. I know that in South Korea, uh, baseball is like a huge thing. So you know how like in usual people soccer is huge. I mean in Korea soccer is huge too, but ba basket uh, not basketball baseball is really huge. And for the record, I'm not uh, interested in neither of them. <laughs> I grew up in Germany, which is goes crazy for all things football. I never really understood the appeal. Is this seriously the boss fight just gonna be this all over again? Oh my. Now I'm just afraid of dying because if I die, that means I'll have to do this shit all over again. Oh fuck! No! No! Uh, is there no flowers? Crap, 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 love it. Crap! If you die now, you're gonna do this all over again! No, stop, stop roaring, you. This boss fight is so tedious, I just don't want to do it over over again. I just want to get get over with it. Right, please. Right, play it safe. Play it safe. Right, no risk taking. God, it's, it's actually tense now. <laughs> it's like that moment in Only Up, where the game itself isn't hard, but you're afraid to do something because you lose everything. You don't want that. One more, one more, one more. Come on. Now we're on the same room. Amount of HP, you and I. You and I are not so much different. There we go. Very anticlimactic. You just jump on his back and you just slam on his head a bit and oh you died. <laughs> what was that for you? <sighs> What was that? <laughs> Cutscene flash.
<laughs> and in the moment it ends, I love how the mu music becomes back to really tense music because I only have one health. <laughs> right, so let's see skills. Okay. Uh. How do I unskill? You can't reset your skill points during combat. Okay, uh, research badge. Yes, there we go, right. Throw rock, yes. Throw a lesson creature and guarantees a death and damage up, right. General finisher, right. Let's do that. Okay, I guess I just go through the canyon now? Oh. What's next? Is it the desert or something? Okay, I just love how the atmosphere just suddenly changes. Like, there's no, like, slow... There's no, like, transition. There's just one thing or the other. The hell? <laughs> the cutscenes are so goofy ass. <laughs> so silly. What are you doing? It's just sniffing, I guess. <gasps> it's a dark jungle, okay. It's not just any jungle. The first one was a regular jungle. This one is a dark jungle. Honestly, they look pretty regular to me. I'm gonna be honest here. Doesn't look very dark to me. It's just jungle. Right? But I guess it couldn't... Recycle the same name twice, right? The JPEG cutscene is near. Is this, this where I go back into the swamp or? Oh yeah, you do. All right. Let's see what kind of unique creatures await us in this jungle. Oh my, what the hell? That was surprising. I'm not falling for the same trick twice though. Just crabs all over again, jeez. Oh, that's cheeky, hiding a heal plant behind a poisonous one. How am I supposed to grab that one? Yoink! Yeah, let's go. I thought I had to do something with this ribcage. I guess not. Down we go. Wait, I don't think we were meant to go this way. Yeah, we were meant to climb it up, yes.
Ah, oh, god dang it. There's one small crack and you had to fall in that, Lofo. Genius. Uh, Lofo is just thinking on another level of... So on another whole plane of intelligence right there. His intelligence is 2D. Right, okay, all right. Uh, the one was bored, right? I don't really say that often, but like... like don't spoil. Okay. Like, I, I, I honestly just felt like that was common sense. Like, and I didn't really say, like, I really didn't say, like, no spoilers when I'm playing it because I thought it was common sense. Like, yeah, maybe you spoil, like, a crucial thing one or two. Maybe, like, the boss fight. Yeah, you told me that you need rocks for the boss fight, so. Yeah, I mean, I can understand that. That's genuinely helpful advice, but, like. Like, no, sp like, spoiling everything? The boss and the creatures and everything? Like, come on, don't you just feel like that's a little bit of a dick move? Uh, you know, as I said, I'm not against the whole idea of just, uh, of you giving me advice that from, from what's happening, gonna happen soon in this game, but like, just common sense, man, common sense. Uh, again, approaching pterosaurs, which means we haven't been here before. What is that? There's something blue in there. Oh, uh, crystal caves. What? Oh, spiders! Come at me, bro! There we go. Wow, that, that was really easy. Wow, okay. Oh! Are those Ovi Raptors? What are you? Come here! That guy's green! It's not an OV rapper, it's just like a green rapper. Why is it just roaring? Is it just stuck? Hey, buddy! Wait, I think I just knocked him into an area where he can just can't hit me. <laughs> I managed to pacify this rap by hitting it so deep into a bush it no longer can attack. Well then, good for you, buddy! Good for you! Am I supposed to go back this way? Something tells me no. Ow! Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh my! Okay. That guy just knocked me all the way down. Okay. Go up, go up, go up! Right. Ah! Yellow guys! <laughs> no! <laughs> alright, alright, man. Damn, we got a, quite a fan base down there. What the hell? 
I can't move. I can't move. Like, I can attack. But I can't move. What was that? That was stupid. See the map. I have literally no fucking clue where I am. <laughs> like, there is no way in hell I'd be able to find out where the hell that place is. Oh, yeah, I can roar, right? It's just over there, right? Okay, it's okay, just take the L. I think I was supposed to go back up this way. Wasn't there another vine? No, that was the vine. Am I supposed to go down? No, right? Where am I supposed to go from here? Do I just seriously go down? Is that what you want? What, what the hell? <laughs> I just slammed an invisible raptor. Yeah, sure, that works. Whatever works, man. Come down here, guys, instead of waiting for me and pushing me down. Like, like the assholes you guys are. Come on. Yeah, exactly. Come on. Yeah, skill issue, man. Third, last but not least. Oh, you want to fight me then? Well, there we go. Confused. Right, this is the reason I hate these kind of games. Right, there is obviously a path, but there's no path that leads up to that path, so you just end up being really confused. I'm frustrated. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, what the hell? These guys are different types from before. These guys have like different privileges. Oh wow, okay, these are pretty savage too, man. Oh, come on! Oh my god! Guys, I think that's it. That's that's gonna be it for today, humans and dinosaurs. So yeah, I think yeah, <laughs> that's gonna be it. So yeah, I, f I think I'm gonna probably play this game next time. So uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you're don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, may the Jurassic Park with you. Uh, bye bye. All right. Honestly, my opinions on this game not as terrible as I thought. 
But it's also because my plate is very, very generous when it comes to dinosaur game. Ooh, I can pick this up. But yes. I honestly didn't find this game that terrible. Like, it's not, it's not as bad as it is. <laughs> oh yeah, but there's one thing that I do want to point out. Like, this game has a DLC, and I think that's, like, worth noting here, right? And the DLC is literally a joke. I, I, I kid you not, right? There is this DLC called Skull Island Rise of Kong Colossal Pack. And all that it does is that you get X8 exclusive film grains, including a red-tinted rage filter. The 1933 Noir and the 1970s Sapia Tone. So you just, lit they literally brought, they, you get to pay, like, how much, how much is the, how much is the DLC? $16 for a DLC that you essentially just add in a fucking filter on it. Like, you don't even get, like, additional boss fights or anything. Like, it's just, 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 just a filter. <laughs> what? Like, who would want to play that something that looks like this? Like, I, I feel it very hard to understand. <laughs> like, what the hell were they thinking? <laughs> like, like, they aren't even trying to hide this. Like, like, h how? <laughs> it's just so silly. Like, oh yeah, this, this is definitely gonna sell. We're just gonna slap on a couple of filters and sell it for $16. Like, you know that I can just change my editing program to make it look like I'm constantly using a Sapia filter, you know it? <laughs> Pick DLC right here. Uh, I, 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 I would unironically buy it if you get, you, you know, you might not. If someone donates $16, I'll buy the DLC. Screw it. <laughs> if someone pays me, I'll do it. But I cannot justify it. Like, who knows? Maybe if the videos do really well, I might. But, like, I, I just cannot see. <gasps> Oh yeah, you know what? There is actually a boss rush mode. Okay, there is a, all the Titans of Skull Island as quickly as possible. And beat your best time. Okay, well. Okay, alright. Eight Kong style varines. Wow, you can get Kong skins? Damn! <laughs> the, the film... I, like, I love how, like, uh, from all these things they could have marketed, like, it was the film grain filters that they chose to advertise. Like, like... Honestly, if you really wanted me to buy the DLC, you could have just added in like a sneak peek of behind the scenes content, or kind of what the boss rush mode looks like, or at least like an example of the eight Kong Marines. No, like the example that they thought like, yeah, this is definitely gonna have have them buy the DLC was the seat was like the stupid filters. Like of all the things, like the filters look like the least inter interesting of all the bunch. Like, at least with the skins, you're kind of curious. <laughs> you're like, oh yeah, maybe. Like, I'm like, yeah, I'm curious as to what they would put out. What kind of shit they would put out to make the Kong as a different color, right? Or, like, I'm genuinely curi curious about the behind the scenes, right? The concept, but I guess that's what's out on Twitter right now. Because I guess someone took the hit, I guess. <laughs> Not me, though. And I do want to kind of want to see what boss rush mode, but what I think it is, is essentially just... You just, it's just the boss fights, just hand in hand in hand, they, they really aren't gonna add in a bunch of extra stuff, it's just gonna be, they're just gonna trim out all the rest of the game, just add in the bosses and call it a day. I feel like that's how it's just gonna be. <laughs> Instead of like an actual, like, a very, like, in-depth, like, boss rush mode, like, I don't really think that's gonna be the case, so. <laughs> yeah, I cannot justify buying this, it's just stupid. <laughs> like, the colossal pack. Jeez, like, this is colossal? Right, okay. I, I, I am actually curious, right? I, I want to see what the global achievements are, right? Okay. Like, 78% of people completed the tutorial. So, like, I guess that means 22% of the people. They didn't even, like, uh, play, uh, uh, they didn't even beat the tutorial, right? And less than half of the entire people who bought the game actually beat the first boss. And I don't think it was because of this, this game's notorious difficulty. Something tells me that that's not the case.
And 11% of people actually finished the final boss. Alright. Wait. What? So, the best fighter... Okay, hold up. The nemesis is the... uh. That's the main boss, right? That's 11%. The spider boss is 11.2%. Uh, wait, 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 wait. No, it's the the nemesis is eleven point seven percent, but the dark creature is eleven point two percent. What? So, like zero point five percent of the population me managed to beat the final boss without beating the spider boss. What? Okay, that's a thing. How did this happen? Uh, 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 right. Okay. So, yeah. So, I think that's going to be it for today, Humans and Dinosaurs. I'm pretty exhausted. I need to edit two videos to upload tomorrow. As I said, a dinosaur keeps his promise. So, I'll be uh, ending the stream now. Oh, so excited. Right? Uh, not, not excited, so exhausted, right? It's been a while since I came back to streaming, so. And worst of all, in like, in, in like five hours, I have another stream, which is like the finale of Arc, uh, of Arc, uh, Arc Survival Evolved, essentially, since I, this is gonna be the final episode on Monarchy, so, I think the ending party starts at 6am, so I do wanna push out, I wanna kinda try and get out a raid, because I did get some cool stuff, uh, I got, I got like a rocket launcher, and I got some arrows and stuff, so, I feel like I might do a little bit of, uh, goofing around before I end this, uh, before I join the, uh, finishing party, so, that's how it's gonna be, so, yeah, so, if I'm doing this video, leave a like, if you haven't done for subscribe, until next time, may the Jurassic Spurp with you. Bye bye.